Hey, honey. Are you awake? <laughs> I didn't wake you up today. Good. I was worried that all my grumbling woke you up. Oh, yeah. The traffic is... Definitely... Definitely too loud. Way too loud. Mm. I can usually sleep through it, but... Mm -hmm. I can usually sleep through it, but... All the lights are so bright, I can even see them through the curtains. There's no position where they aren't shining in my eyes and making it impossible to sleep. No, I already tried that. Either I face the window and stare directly at the lights, or I roll over and face the mirror, and the reflection of the lights tries to burn my eyes right out of my head. It's a lose lose situation, you know? <laughs> it's definitely part of the problem. No, I always have had a hard time sleeping during the holidays. Because it gets so busy and stressful. It's the most exhausting time of year and yet, even now that the holidays are almost over, I still can't sleep. <laughs> but at least we're through the worst of it now. All the busiest parts are done and we don't have to worry about them anymore. No more crowded gatherings, no more taking uncomfortable pictures for social media, no more awkward conversations with people we barely know. It's gonna be a lot easier from now on. <laughs> I was saying that to reassure myself, actually, but I'm glad it helps you, too. <laughs> no, but seriously, I'm glad we're done with, like, the big holiday stuff. It was fun and everything, but it has me feeling exhausted. Completely drained and with a non-existent social battery. <laughs> Oh, honey, don't pout like that. You know I always have enough energy for you. <laughs> no, honey. Come on, don't roll over. <laughs> no, come back. I promise I wasn't talking about you. Of course not. You're the love of my life. I always have more than enough energy for you. I have, like, an entirely different energy supply for you, and it never runs out because I love you so much. Nope. It's a love battery. <laughs> and love batteries never run out of love. They're like a... Oh, what's the word? They're eternal. That's what I wanted to say. <laughs> That's exactly what I'm saying. My love for you is eternal, and I'll always be happy to be around you. Because you're my honey. <laughs> Was that romantic enough to get you to turn around? <laughs> Yay! Thank you, sweetie. Come here, let me give you a kiss. <laughs> See? Love battery is very full right now. Hell, it's even overflowing, you know? <laughs> mm. But honestly, the best part of the holidays being done is that I get to have you all to myself again. Mm-hmm. We've barely gotten to spend time together besides when we go to bed. It's been torture spending our days running around trying to get stuff done. I just kept hoping we'd finally have a calm moment to spend together, but everything was so busy that we never did. Now that we're done with all that, you're all mine for the night. And since we both have tomorrow off, you're gonna be mine all day too. Of course, whatever you want to do, we'll do it. 
but I'd definitely prefer if it was something that didn't require leaving the house. It's too cold and I don't want to put on actual clothes where I could just spend the day in with pajamas. Hmm. A marathon, huh? That sounds good. What show were you thinking of? Oh, that's perfect. I haven't watched it in so long. That'd be perfect for a marathon. We should still have some leftovers in the fridge so we don't have to worry about making something. We'll be good to just watch TV and cuddle and kiss all day long. Oh, of course there's gonna be kissing. I haven't had the chance to kiss you under any mistletoe yet, so... You better bet that I bought some on my way home. I'm gonna hang it up everywhere so I get to kiss you as much as possible. Oh, please. I can never get tired of kissing you. <laughs> nope, never. You're my honey. That means you're as sweet as... Mm, as... Honey. <laughs> mm. I really did miss this. I miss getting to have these nice quiet moments with just the two of us. There's nowhere else I'd rather be right now than right here beside you. <laughs> well, maybe I'd rather be somewhere quieter and less busy, but only if I get to bring you along with me. <laughs> Thank you, honey. Now come here, let me cuddle up with you. You know that's how I always sleep best. <sighs> oh yeah. This is much better. I can even lean my head against yours so I can't see any of the lights. I swear, you just get more and more perfect every day. You're like the most perfect person to ever exist, you know that? Well, to me you are. And that's what really matters, right? <laughs> that's a discussion we can have in the morning. I'm still really exhausted, and clearly you're just as tired as me since you can't even keep your eyes open. Why don't you lay your head against my chest? I'll block out some of the sound for you. That way, I won't have to be blinded by the lights, and you don't have to keep waking up every time some jackass decides that everyone in a 50 mile radius needs to hear how loud they can rev their engine. Hmm. Yeah, just like that. Are you comfortable, honey? Good. I'm gonna pull these blankets up around us so I can finally get some sleep. Alright, there we go. I love you, and I can't wait to annoy you with all of my love tomorrow. <laughs> That's not a threat, but it's not not a threat. <laughs> Sleep well, honey, okay? I love, love, love you. Dreams of